Hi, I'm Randolph Miller, and welcome to Bounce Around Charleston. Hundreds to receive test day, thanks to the funding from Employees Community Fund of Boeing, South Carolina. Low Country Aid Services receives grants to offer free hepatitis C testing. Adam Weaver, Prevention Program Manager, is here to tell us all about this program. Adam, <laughs> welcome to Bounce Around Charleston. Hi, thank you for having me. I've seen commercials that talk about hepatitis C, mm -hmm. and in the commercials they're always stating that people really don't know that they have it. How true is that? Uh, it's very true. I guess what the research is finding is that the majority of cases of hep C are asymptomatic, so you may not feel anything at all, and if you do, you might just kind of feel the symptoms of a cold, you might get a fever, you might feel sick and kind of just brush that off. Um, but people can live years, even decades, with a hepatitis C infection without even knowing. But how would they know it unless they went to have that testing? Right, absolutely. And so one of the things that we're also noticing is that hep C testing isn't a part of regular blood work with your doctor. You know, I think a lot of people go to the doctor and they think, well, yeah, I got tested for everything. Mm -hmm. And when we say, well, what is everything? Uh, and usually hepatitis C is not included in that. Wow. And so we're thankful for Boeing uh, giving us the opportunity through this grant to be able to offer free rapid testing uh, for anyone who's interested. So Low Country Aid Services is getting involved to make sure we have a healthy community. Absolutely. Yeah, that's what we've been dedicated to for the past 26 years uh, with our HIV and STI screenings. And we're really excited to be able to add on this other service, uh, especially I think it's projected anywhere from 25 to 30,000 unidentified cases of hepatitis C uh, in South Carolina alone, almost 4 million cases in the United States. Um, so we're very excited to be able to offer this service to people. You were sharing something with me early about the baby boomers. Tell yes. us about that. Yeah, so there's a couple of different recommendations that the CDC has for people who should get tested. And one group in particular is baby boomers, so people born between 1945 and 1965. Uh, what they found is that about 75% of the cases of hep C uh, are actually in the baby boomer generation, uh, mostly because the screenings for hep C weren't available back in the day when those folks may have been getting some medical procedures. Mm -hmm. So baby boomers, they're recommended to get tested at least once in their lifetime. Uh, if you use IV drugs, uh, if you have a partner uh, that's hep C positive, if you are having unprotected sex with an anonymous partner, uh, if you have home tattoos or piercings, things like that, uh, we recommend that you come in and get tested. So hep C deals with the blood. Mm -hmm. Yes, yeah, it's actually the most common uh, blood-borne disease uh, in the country um, and it's a virus that will impact your liver and it'll cause liver damage it can potentially lead to liver cancer um, and so that's why it's really really important to get that screening because you might not know it but you could have been doing damage to your liver for years okay so when a person come in and they're tested mm -hmm. and if they discover that they have hep C mm -hmm. then what's the follow-up so we are going to assist them uh, after they do our rapid test, which takes only 20 minutes to get your results. Uh, we can help them to get a viral load test, which will confirm whether they have hepatitis C or not. About 20% of people can clear it on their own. We don't really know why, it's just part of their anatomy. Mm -hmm. um, so we do a, a viral load test to confirm, uh, and once we have that, we have several different avenues of medical care that we can help link them to. Okay, so then now tell us what should a person do to get tested? Yeah, so uh, come to Low Country Aid Services. We're at 3547 Meeting Street Road in North mm -hmm. Charleston, uh, right off the Dorchester Road exit from 26. Uh, we do testing Monday through Thursday, 830 to 3.30. No appointment needed. Just walk in, let us know that you're interested in a test, and we can get you those results in 20 minutes. Okay, is there a number for the Low Country in reference to Hep C? Um, not that I know off the top of my head, but you can always call our office uh, and we can link you with some of those services. Our number is 843-747-2273. Okay. Well, Adam, we thank you for sharing that information yeah. with us. And for more information, uh, Adam, no, A. Weaver at AidServices.com mm -hmm. or 843-747-2273 to get more information about the hepatitis C testing. Yeah. We thank you and thank we you. thank Boeing. Yes, um, yes. Oh, you know what? You were talking something to me about 
hoping to get a van. That, that would be good, wouldn't it? It would. Uh, well, that's something that we have in the works, and we're hoping to uh, be able to make our testing mobile so we can really get out to some high-needs communities. So be on the lookout for that in the future. Okay, okay. Yeah. Thank you, Adam, for being here and sharing all this information about hep C testing. Well, coming up next, right here on Bounce Around Charleston, Cole Peace, Christopher Johnson. He's an artist. He's up next, right after this break. Thank you. 